Hello everyone, I'm your host Sakuma and welcome back to another episode of Golden Sun for Game Boy Advance. In our previous episode, uh, man, what did happen? It's been a long time. I've been really sick and unable to record anything. I barely remember what's going on. I think we're going up the mountain to collect mushrooms for alchemy or something like that. I don't know, I'll figure it out as we go along. Uh, who are you? Welcome, weary wanderers. What do you seek? Revive, cure poison, repel evil, remove curse. Okay, so it's like a sanctuary of sorts. Who are you? Our synergy was given to us by the sacred power of Mount Aleph. Synergy is what grants the wishes of the chosen people. Okay. Synergy is a power that should only be used for good, never for evil. Well, now I know what's going to happen to the villain. So, whoa, hello there. Who? What? You're not planning on sneaking up to Mount Aleph, are you? What's sneaking? I'm just going up. Mount Aleph is a sacred peak. No one can climb it without permission. Okay. Oh, uh -huh. you didn't see me. Craden is waiting for us. We should go to his house. Who? Where's Craden at? Hello. I'm leaving. Nope, I wasn't trying to this time. I'll overlook it this time. <laughs> but I've got my eye on you, Isaac. Okay. So where is this Kraden? Who is this Kraden? Veil vale stays pristine because of Mount Aeolus' purity. Taint that purity and you risk terrible retribution. Okay. Hi. Do you need to go past? Sure. You must be going to Kraden's cottage. Alright. They seem to know little of Soul Sanctum's mysteries. You're back? Elders of Vale must not permit anyone to enter it. Not even Kraden. Can we use him? Mm, his knowledge is no meager theme. We can use him. But he's more stubborn than we expected. And cunning too. Cunning beyond measure. If he won't go willingly, then we can always... Hi! You there! What are you doing? What are we doing? Were you eavesdropping on our conversation? No, we were just walking this way. Hmm, I guess I should take you at your word. Hey, you're the ones who are sneaking around. Sneaking. Who are you to accuse me? So Creighton's engagement was with you. Yeah, we're off to meet him right now. And this appointment is important enough to drive us away? Uh, maybe not? Nevertheless, Creighton sent us away. He awaits you. I'm trying to be polite here, I don't... Go. Okay. You're letting us go? Are you sure, Sat... Satteros? Mr. Saturn. <laughs> oh, wow. Minority, we have no reason to, to delay these children any further. Let's go, Isaac. Okay, bye! So, Mr. Saturn and... Crit something. I heard nothing. Really? You mean I'm the only one that hears them? Probably. Now, I know that they are established as characters, but really, I just want to call them... Jesse and James from Pokemon. Quite honestly. Maybe I'll figure out their names later on. Just who were they? They already know too much about Soul Sanctum. Things that even the Elders of Vale don't know. And just what were they saying about the elements? The elements of alchemy. Earth Water, fire, and wind. No heart? They plan to set them into motion? And the four elemental stars are the key? These are things that even I, a trained alchemy sage, do not know. I'm totally butchering what everybody's saying. Hello, you need help with the elements? I am the Avatar! Oh, Isaac. You look like something's bothering you. Me? Ah, uh, well. It's those two, isn't it? Saturos and Minardi were their names, right? It's 
Patros and Renard. I have to remember those. I'm going to have them as Jesse and James in my mind for the entirety of this game, but... Satoros and Minardi. Are they still out there? They're very persistent. Did they want something from you, Kraden? That seems to be the case. Seems to be? Now Aleph and Soul Sanctum. They spoke as if they'd seen them with their own eyes. Isn't that strange? Uh, should it be? I want to say no. Yes? I'll say no because I can probably get more information that way. Why well, I had to wait many years before I was allowed into the sanctum. Of course it's strange. Oh, okay. And if they entered secretly, then they might be thieves. We have to go tell the high elders and the villagers. Wait, everyone. Speculation just kind of screws things up. I still don't know how accurate the things they said were. We can do nothing until we confirm what they told me. Then what should we do? Well, we go confirm it. Do you mean we should go into Soul Sanctum ourselves? Yeah, what the heck. Isn't that impossible? Why would it be? I don't know anything! Just because climbing Mount Aleph is forbidden? Um... No, there's probably some other stuff keeping us from getting in there. That's right. We're just going to see if they've been to Mount Aleph. Oh, okay. We'll be fine if they don't see us, right? Oh, sure! We won't be doing anything bad up there. This will be just our secret, okay? Totally! Along with anybody else I tell on the way. Then it's decided! We'll make you the leader, okay, Isaac? Fine by me, I'm the protagonist. There are some dangerous places between Mount Aleph and Soul Sanctum. But you can handle it, right, Isaac? You're more cautious than Garrett is, Isaac, so you'll be fine. You don't have to be so blunt. Now, who was it trying to drag their valuables with them when a boulder was going to crash on his head three years ago? I think I'm more capable than you are. A random wiggly bottle in the air. This is our best bet. A wiggly bottle. Let's go! Yay! Everybody's on my party now. Can I see anything up there? Any monsters? Ooh. That'll be fun to explore later. Okay, anything else up here? Anything else? It uh, doesn't look like it. What about in your house? What is this thing? I can't investigate it. What about this book? Oh, I checked the jar instead. Oh, yay! I can get stuff now! Stop it. Come on, Isaac. Come on! Okay, nothing in that. I wonder if... Darn it. Nope. I wonder if jars are going to be the only thing that's going to have anything in them. I'll check this barrel down here, just because I can. And this lamp, no. Nothing in the books. Study of alchemy. To understand alchemy, one must understand the elemental powers. That's where the script ends. <laughs> Great! How much did you pay for that book? Okay, there's... I was trying to investigate the theme beside it, but no. In search of the ancient Lemurians. Okay. I don't want to read it. There's a book entitled The Fountain of Tolby. The Fountain of Tolby will test your luck. We like to call it Russian Roulette. Encyclopedia of Alchemy. All things are composed of those four that we already know. Okay. Alright. On our way. And we're not going to talk to that guy again. I guess we can fight some monsters if we go down south, but yeah, whatever. Now I need to sneak by this guy. There you are. Hi! Bye! Can I get around you here? No. Just gonna stay down here. I am standing on the stairs watching you do your practice. I am taking note of how devout a follower you are of what you practice. Bye now! Soul entrance! Yeah! Oh my gosh, we're going into the sun. Wow, that opened really easily. Why'd they even have a door there in the first place? 
This is the entrance to Soul Sanctum. This is your first time here, right? Well, it's my first time here. It's an important relic of our past. Take a good look at it. It is a bunch of rocks with purple lights. At least they're not red. Well, this should be fun. An unnecessary puzzle! Okay, I can't jump that distance. Back we go. This reminds me of something. I'm not sure what... Oh, I remember. I forgot. I'm not sure. <laughs> Never mind. I have jumped on all the rocks. Okay. Anybody in here? The monsters... Uh, yep. Just like that. Whole bunch of bats. Wow. Dane, Garrett has become huge in three years. My goodness. All right. You attack, and you attack, and you attack. Looking good. Come on, Garrett. I was expecting you to do more. Your sword is bigger. I figured it would hurt. Be a lot heavier. Alright, so you attack that one, you attack that one, you attack that, and kill them. That one's dead, that one's dead. Bat tries to attack, but whatever, he's dead too. Awesome. It's actually kind of fun. The monsters just fly out of you from nowhere when you're not looking. It's like, okay, things are going pretty good. Uh, nope. Suddenly I'm in a battle. There was barely even a cutscene. Okay, you will attack the vermin. Because that's all I trust you to attack. And you should... Eh, yeah, bat. That's a tough mushroom. Tough vermin, too. Okay, now you'll attack the bat. I will get the mushroom, and you get the vermin. The vermin is not dead. Why is the vermin not yet dead? Okay. You... No, wait, 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 wait. I have another idea. I have another idea. How about if you attack the vermin, I use... Let's do attack on the vermin, even though it might die anyway. And synergy flare on the bat. That's a lot of damage. Okay. That was much better. Carry on. Okay, let's see what we've got going on here. I'm thinking the right side. I'm thinking we need to go up the middle. I looked a little too far ahead. Where are we going? Hello! I gave a small jewel to Garrett. What is this? Uh, Garrett has a small jewel. An important item. Okay. I guess Garrett can hold on to it. No, go back this way. I'm hoping that if we go left, the story will continue. So let's look on the right and get into a battle. Okay. It feels much easier now. Oh, how... Not sure how that works, but okay. That's kind of confusing to read. Okay. Do what? It's a relief of a minotaur. The right eye is sparkling, but there's a hole where the left eye should be. Looks to me like the... Oh, wait, you mixed around. Yeah, okay. So I'm probably going to have to put that jewel in there. No idea why someone took it out and defaced the monument. That's supposed to be a sacred relic of the village, but... Okay. Now I look over here... And... Get into a battle! Okay! Everybody attack! Everybody attack! Just slaughter the bat! Slaughter the bat! Alright, we're gonna have drumsticks for dinner tonight. Bat drumsticks. Is there anything in here? Nothing. Okay. Run back to the other side! Why did they even have that over there in the, to begin with? Completely pointless. Nope! Th this way? I know how to play games! I'm good at games! Da, 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 da. Okay. So, oh wait. Okay, then you go in here and use the item. 
use. Isaac set the small gem into the empty socket. You hear the sound of shifting stone. Now I go to the left side. Okay. I thought that was going to be like an elevator. Okay, vermin. <sighs> okay, both of you attack and... Synergy! I said before that it replenishes while we walk, right? So I'm not too worried about running out right now. Maybe, maybe if it gets down to like half or something, then I'll start worrying. There we go. What you thinking? What you thinking? What's wrong, Craden? Mm, those two said there was a hidden passage leading deeper into the sanctum. I've come here many times, and I've always thought it looked strange. I wasn't really looking, but okay. I had always imagined Soul Sanctum would look different somehow. What do you mean? Soul Sanctum was built in honor of the sun. Oh, well, I got that part right at least. There ought to be something here to reflect that. I was always puzzled why there wasn't. If there is a hidden passage, then maybe it leads to... Well, let's see if we can find it. I think he's serious. Should we help him, Isaac? Why wouldn't he be serious? No, he's just joking around. He wants us to think there is. That's too dangerous for us to split up. We should stay together. Are there going to be monsters in here, too? While I'm trying to solve a puzzle? I can understand why there would be, but... It seems a little... Ridiculous. Let's see if I can push you. Oh, look! I found something! Wait, wouldn't there be something on the other side, then? Yeah. And suddenly, but... Okay, slime! Took him a while to appear. How about you attack that slime, you attack the same slime, and flare! Oh! It attacks- okay, now I understand that much. Alright, Garrett, kill it. Now, butt mashing! Okay, now I understand it a little bit- oh, I missed it, I missed it. Wasn't paying attention. Who grew up? Was it Garrett? Somebody, somebody grew a level and I don't know who. Status. Who? Oh, Isaac. Okay, so Isaac went up a level and he learned a whole bunch of stuff that I completely missed. Oh, Quake. Yeah, I thought I saw the word Quake. Can we use it in battle? Okay. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's this? On the side of it, it shows a red and an orange orb? That, is that a synergy? Status is normal. A for synergy. Why would I... Okay, now I see. I thought retreat was like, run from battle. <laughs> I want to cast magic to run from battle, but my feet work just fine. So, cure, move, eh. I think using my hands has been working just fine. Retreat to go back to the entrance and quake to attack. Okay. And I was not paying attention to the other stuff. I will have to pay attention next time I get a level up from anybody. In fact, next battle, I'm going to have to slow down the text. Okay! You attack that one, you attack that one, and you burn everybody. So, Slime 2 guts took 12 from the attack. The one I focused on took 23. Okay. Garrett is now a level 2 guard. HP goes up, PP goes up, attack rises, that's good. Defense rises, also good. Agility, 4 coins. Alright. Not bad, then. Aha! Guarded, of course. Why don't you attack the mushroom? You... Quake! And then flare. Bam! That was cool. And then burn everybody. Not bad, not bad. Slime's party goes down. Yay! HP, PP, attack, defense, agility, six coins. 
Now something I should probably check after this chest. Another small jewel, okay. Every time I push start, that menu opens. I want to check status of pretty much everybody, I guess. Okay, so one thing that I am um, trained in Pokemon is that there are two types of attacks, physical and special. But it looks like the only kind of attack power there is is just attack. So there is no difference between physical attacks and synergy attacks. So hers is 24, 31, 27. I'm obviously the strongest member. Somehow she's the weakest. Or is agility... I don't know. I should really have a game manual or something like that. Okay, so I'm actually going to use Isaac's Cure Synergy to heal probably everybody, I guess. Yeah. And he can recover it as time goes on. And that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you everyone for joining me for Golden Sun today. Finally getting into a plot. We met Jesse and James. Darn it. I mean, what was it? So, Laris and... Man, I have to write those names down or something. I will never remember. Anyway, plot's moving along quite nicely. We're getting into some nice battles. Not really any I wanted to cut out so far, I think. They're quite entertaining. We're actually learning in the battles, which is cool. So, come back next time, everybody, when we will explore the soul dungeon, solstice, whatever, a little bit deeper. Take care, and see you then.